All right, so I wanted to clear up what I was doing here. Here's my netbook, practice amp, real amp, master volume uh, needs to be replaced, so I'm just running that over here. The output of my computer, which is right here, goes into the input of the amp, and right here is a Rocksmith cable from Xbox. Crap. Goddamn thing. I have to tape that with some gaff tape. Just one second. Ugh. Okay, and that runs into quarter inch into this base. All right, so over here, go ahead. I already have my uh, loop MIDI internal loop program running. It starts on startup, so that's going. So I'm going to turn on MIDI guitar. I have MIDI bass as well, but it doesn't work nearly as well. So I'm using MIDI guitar right now. Using the trial version. That tells me it's working. That's why you have to turn the audio microphone and headphones off, or that happens. So right now the input of MIDI guitar is my Rocksmith cable, and the output is the internal MIDI program. So now I'm going to turn on Massive. Ooh, shaky. Drink too much coffee today. <clears throat> and unless I have, you know, a demo fail, this should work right out of the box. So then we're going to go ahead and check our audio and MIDI settings. And it shows that we have the same, oh, shaky, shaky, same internal MIDI channel is on. So with any luck, this will make some noise. Let me see. All right. So I have it working in the base. I'm going to basically, hopefully, the iPhone speaker can pick this up because it's going to be super low frequencies. I'm using the dub trimmer preset. And here we go. fine-tuned it I just have it working so that's what I'm working on